お盛りをかけたい休日をいつかお聞きいただきますお一人様に番号のついている年の上をお聞きください
On your left is stage 27. That is where we built the interior of Mission Control for our hit motion picture, Apollo 13. And recently we used stage 27 for a new motion picture entitled Land of the Lost. It stars Will Ferrell. It's based on the 1970s Saturday morning television show called Land of the Lost. How about we go from the big screen to the small screen and talk about our television history? Aside from making memorable movies, NBC Universal has a long history of producing hit TV shows, many of which filmed right here on the Universal lot. Well, our television history dates back some 67 years of our first television broadcast. It's the opening day ceremonies of the 1939 year of World's Fair. Since then, we produced and televised some of the biggest shows on network television. That would have gone Saturday Night Live, The Tonight Show, The Cosby Show, Friends, ER, Law & Order, Crossing Jordan, Seinfeld, The Office, my name is Earl, and the list goes on and on. The look is still going. And after that list, their new show, Life, starring Damian Lewis. They film at stage 44 on your right. Coming up on your left is a series of 10 bungalows. They're production offices. The production office is the nerve center for motion pictures and television shows and film on the lot. Among the bungalows, the Albert Hitchcock production bungalow. Albert Hitchcock managed to make appearances in almost all of his films. I have some of those cameos. See if you can spot Mr. Hitchcock. That one doesn't count. All right, well, yeah. There he is. There he is. Good evening. Who is that? My name is Albert Hitchcock. We all know a little mad sometimes. I know, I do. Alfred Hitchcock can get down like that. Well, all you Alfred Hitchcock fans are in for a treat. Coming up on your left is the second biggest Mr. Patini that I've ever seen. And I digress. That is uh, where the Hasbro production office is. They're working on a couple of movies on our lot based on board games, uh, such as Monopoly and Candyland. Oh, also on your left, bundle of 5195. That's the Albert Hitchcock logo next to the number, the big green door. That was the Albert Hitchcock production office for the Albert Hitchcock Presents television series. They were there in the front lot when we do one of our interior building. They take me to the back lot we do the large scale exterior building. We're going to show you sets from some of your favorite movies and television shows. The sets that you'll see on our back lot may look like real buildings, but they're not. They're what we call facades, just the false fronts and sides of buildings. The only building the camera needs to see, what looks like brick and concrete, is actually foam rubber and fiberglass. And it's the job of the art director to make sure that these sets are just differently, so you don't recognize them from one production to the next, since so many productions are filmed in the same areas. These scenes that you're watching were all filmed on our lot. Over the years, Universal's won quite a few Academy Awards for art direction. Off to your left, you will see a glimpse of some of the facades on the back wall. Uh, the facades that you're about to see are featured in such films as To Kill a Mockingbird, Bruce Almighty, Back to the Future, and Changeling. And they've been featured in several television shows that include episodes of 24, starring Keeper Sutherland. And currently, that uh, group of facades is the exterior of the town of Grandview, the Ghost Whisperer, star Jennifer Love Hewitt. Right now they are constructing some new sets for us, the sets we lost in the fire last year. It's a metropolitan area, but it's less than 1% of the back lot. We still have over...